to you guys but i'm back with another vlog i woke up this morning wanting to shoot a tiktok you guys know i'm going to be home for some time so one of the things that actually make me go back to cape town very quickly when i come visit my family is because i'm not doing anything i'm not shooting content my socials are dry and i just want to get back into filming for you guys you know so i told myself this time around that you know what my mom is a content creator mom herself she's got a ring light she's got tripods if you don't follow my mom on socials check the description box for her inst excuse me for her instagram and her youtube but anyway i'm using some of her stuff and some of my stuff to shoot some content i'm doing what i eat in a day for tiktok you guys are obviously just gonna see as the vlog goes by what i eat and everything like that i've already kind of prepped everything and started it up but yeah if you're new to my channel hey welcome click the subscribe button and the notification button which is a little bell honey if you want to know when i post and if you're a tiny subscriber hey girl period okay period so yeah you guys are flashing you're going red I'm gonna put you guys on the charger while I continue to make this TikTok. I thought maybe I'll show you guys what I made. I'm making breakfast. So I'm making like um I don't know. My mom and sister put me onto this salami sandwich that they make. So they basically put like is it pastrami or salami? I don't know. Let me check. Let me check for you guys. Smoked salami. So they put smoked salami, cheese, boiled eggs, and that's the sandwich. I'm gonna toast it, however, just to add a little bit of za 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 za. And then, yeah, I thought I was gonna go out for breakfast today, but girl, maybe another day. I just hate how, like, everything's just so far. Also, when I stay in Cape Town, I do travel quite a distance to, like, go out. So I don't know why I'm acting all brand new when I'm home. Also, um, I might be going out with Lelo sometime this week. Um, I did message her yesterday, and we said that we will just, like, communicate this week on when we can go out. I'd really love to see her, you know, and meet her. We always talking on the socials listen she's such a girl's girl like i love her vibes i love her energy already and i haven't even met her and i've been loving her vibes and her energy so yeah and all my friends are just busy they're in relationships they don't have time for me girls so i was just like you know what let me make new friends let me make new friends so yeah that's that that's the tea mm. My eggs are boiling and I think they're about to ring right now. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, I feel like this is probably why people feel so crazy. Like, when they're at home and they don't work and, 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 like, why you, like, why it's very easy for you then to feel like they're not doing anything, you know? Because, like, just, like, me being here at home, my dad's gone to work, my mom's gone to work, my sister's gone to work, my brother stays at his own place, he's gone to work as well. And it's just like Lebahang, if I didn't have anything to do and I just sat at home, do you, like I get I get how it can make someone like how it can get in your head, how it can make you think all these other things about your life. <clears throat> and, and 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 it's quite crazy, like it's quite crazy. So yeah, um I get it. I really get it. Like I really, really get it. Cause it's like everybody has their own lives, everybody has things to do everybody has like a job and you're here at home doing nothing and nothing is wrong with that honestly especially if you are like still looking if you're still searching it's not like you're sitting at home doing nothing and being comfortable with just like being in that situation you know i feel like it's different when you're actively searching and actually trying to do something about it so but yeah i get it at, at first i didn't really understand but now i get it i really do but anyway guys um speaking of looking for jobs i need to sit down and also just like look my brother gave me a few tips yesterday on how to like look for a job um he also gave me an extra app to download um that also helped him because my brother has just been getting better jobs and better jobs and better jobs 
so um yeah he gave me a few tips and tricks so i'm gonna do that i'm gonna get into the new app he told me to download yesterday and yeah just be in my job searching era because clearly there's nothing better i can do honestly i love this life like if i had my own businesses going on and they were like really like succeeding and like flourishing and just orders every single day i wouldn't mind staying at home like honestly being a stay-at-home mom stay-at-home wife housewife like i feel like i'd love that life as long as like i'm busy with my own things on the side and i've got my own flexible schedule um that would be great i would love that so much actually so 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 much i love this honestly i really do that's how when i do get a job there's a time when one of the lecturers at my school asked for my cv because of this other internship or job what 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 and i was literally crying and sending her my cv because i'm like oh my gosh my life is changing now <laughs> it's not gonna be the same i'm gonna be clocking in for work every single day and clocking out late i'm not gonna have time for myself i'm not gonna have time for my craft i was just crying because i was just like i know this is not the life i want for myself like i don't want a job especially a job where like i'm clocking in at 8 30 i'm clocking out at 4 30 like <sighs> if, if maybe my job who's calling me hi mom hi. yeah as i was saying like um it's not the life I want for myself. I know that like I'm destined for it better. Um, I know my dreams. I know what I want for myself in my life. And a job is just not it at all. Yes, it might be taking me really long to get to to get myself to where I want to be. And that is with like my businesses and stuff. And I think also one of the things that are getting in the way is money. I've got so many business ideas, so many, but money. I need money, okay? I try to get my dad to just like fund my businesses and he's just being so professional about it and I really just need him to be like here's the money go do what you want to do you know and he's just being so professional about it like right do a business plan do this do this do that so I'm really just like uh, I don't want to do all that <laughs> I don't want to do all that and that means clearly I don't want the money as much as I say I do because I would have gotten straight to drafting a business plan and everything but yeah so maybe I should just get a job make some money use that money to find other things or other sources that will make me more money but anyway guys let me check the emails like my mom asked me to so I've put myself some OJ And then here is my sandwich. Hey my darlings, it is a few hours later. I'm currently getting ready for Pilates. My sister is turning me into a Pilates girl. I wanna show you guys my outfit. So you guys know this jersey, you know it from my Shein haul on TikTok if you guys haven't seen it. And then I'm wearing this two-piece athletic set from Shein as well on my TikTok. And I've got this cute little hair tie thing at the back here, which I also got from Shein. Super cute. My bandana, which I also got from Shein, okay. She's a Shein girly without wanting to really be a Shein girly, but it's okay, it's okay. I'm about to set up my bottle, pack in my stuff. I don't even know what people take with to Pilates. I know I need my water bottle. What is this? Okay. I know I need my water bottle. I need a small little towel. Um, like a gym towel what else do I need I don't need my showering stuff because I am gonna shower here at home I'm so excited but I'm also so scared at the same time because it's like people have been going on about how Pilates are so difficult like it's very it's very intense girl okay and listen I'm all for the workout but I'm scared at the same time okay but yeah, if you guys want to see me getting ready for my Pilates, go check on TikTok. I do have a get ready with me there. I don't know if this is where my pimple was 
or if I'm like, I don't know what that thing is, so let me not even speak on it because I don't know much about it. So anyway, guys, I will catch you when I'm making my way to Pilates. We're going to do a little drive with me as I'm making my way there. I hope there's no traffic <sighs> because it is during the week. When the real one holds you down, babe, you're supposed to drink. You ain't never went on boss, bitch. I turned you up. Won't tell you twice. It'll be all right. And I'm going to fight. Period. Yeah, the hell sweet away today, birthday, you go out of town. Brokey, I talk a lot of me. He likes who you think you is, nigga, not your beast. And back. And back and lengthen and to the side and change sides. And all the way over, stretch, and up, and all the way over, stretch, and up, two, and all the way up, and three, all the way up, and four, and up, and up, three, Hey, my darlings i am back from pilates honestly how was it, it was bad on like there were exercises that were bearable it's just also i'm very unfit i just last week monday was my first time back at the gym then after that i got my periods then i didn't go until i was done with my periods which i only finished like yesterday two days ago so basically i was just unfit honestly i was too unfit for pilates but i think even if i was fit it would have killed me girl okay pilates is not for the week we all know this like i don't want to tell you guys things that we've been hearing i never went through with the mentality of i'm not gonna die i knew i was gonna die girl okay i knew i was gonna die but you know what pat on the back to myself i did okay um, the whole session I was just thinking like am I coming back? Am I coming back? I'm not coming back Because like there are things for some people and there are things that are just not for everybody, you know And I feel like Pilates is one of them, but I mean I can put myself to the challenge I, I love a good challenge. So maybe I'll go back. Maybe not I guess sure, but we'll see child I know my sister's gonna be like don't I go to Pilates with me and I'm just gonna say yes because I was literally sitting at home the whole day today and i went because and you know i need to like be active and stuff so i was just like let's go to pilates so yeah that's how it went um yeah it was okay shame it was really really okay thanks to my sister for inviting me i'm definitely gonna go again i have a feeling i'm gonna go again yep but anyway guys i'm back home i need to get out of the car and go inside shower have dinner and just see my family because it's just been me the whole day everybody's got work everybody's booked and busy but your girl so i can't wait to just see my mom see my sister carry okay, so my sister pilates i saw my dad my dad kind of works from home and then he goes like for meetings and stuff that's the time like he travels so yeah more of a story i need to go back inside but i just wanted to let you guys know how pilates was okay y'all just saw me punching huffing and puffing in those clips girl okay looks easy but it's not it's not but anyway guys let me go back inside i'll see you guys tomorrow whatever it is i'm doing tomorrow i really do want to do the um iced coffee um I think tomorrow I'm gonna go to Woolies, literally just down the street, and get like caramel syrup and stuff like that to make like nice, cute iced coffees. Cause yeah. Anyway. Hey, my darlings, it is a new day. My hair is not installed. <clears throat> I went to the salon yesterday to go do cornrows and, um, relax my hair it has grown so much like so 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 much i'm actually really happy about that i don't know why my hair has like all these bumps i need to wash this wig so yeah my hair has grown so much which i'm like really really happy and excited about um 
what else did i want to tell you guys yeah so i went to the salon yesterday i am gonna spend a few days with that like really installing my wig and that's because you guys are a bit slanted and that's because i want to apply some minoxidil on my hairline for my hairline growth so um i just have to spend a few days without um putting anything on really i mean without installing my hair on without installing my hair sorry guys it's in the morning and i didn't really get time to process the day because i last night i was thinking and i'm like i need to go to pilates in the morning um i booked a 12 o'clock 12 o'clock the 12 o'clock class pilates reformers class and i went to sleep in the morning when my alarm rings i'm like mm, do i really want to go to pilates do i really want to wake up do i really want to go to pilates on my own the first time i went with my sister and i was just like eh, let me just sleep and something just in me something was just like just get up and go like get up and go you can't sleep the whole day and just laze around the house the whole day just go to pilates so that's what i'm doing i also need to stop at um Ma not macro um mr price home after the um session to go buy glass drawers because i do want to make some iced coffee and yeah that's that on that i did think about like whether i want to guys you know all those like life-changing thoughts that you have at like 12 a.m 3 a.m and you just want to change your life and you just make plans for the next day like yeah i'm gonna wake up early i'm gonna make myself breakfast i'm gonna go to the gym after the gym i'm going to go to a cafe and work and do this believe those thoughts those are the thoughts that will really change your life around those are the thoughts that will really get you on the right track to like becoming the person that you want to be not these thoughts when you suddenly wake up in the morning and you just back to your lazy self again you're back to like your comfort zone no no no. all the plans you make in the evening i mean in the ams when you just can't sleep and you're just thinking about your life stick to those plans stick to those every plan that you make at that time stick to it because girl i also wanted to like go to a cafe and like just work and by work i mean like just open my laptop and just apply for jobs just constantly just apply for jobs um i just don't know where to go i'm in Joburg. I, I don't know the best places to go and like just smoke shisha and be on your laptop where people are minding their business and you're minding yours so yeah but i'm gonna look i'm gonna look around and see and then just get to applying i just want to know that like i did something while being at home like i just want to know i did something even though with my content i definitely did do something like i'm not just sitting at home doing nothing but anyway i've got an apple for breakfast i don't know how long it's gonna take us to get to i don't know how long it's gonna take us to get to the gym let me check you guys are actually on You guys were sitting on my phone. Let's see. Um, 22 minutes, so 11.35. That's really not bad. Maybe I might just like stop and get myself an iced coffee. Instead of having to make one. I don't know. Let me plan some music to just like cheer your girl up. Uh, no, I want a cold. 
surprise for a call to move from keep button pressed for approximately two seconds okay. the button light will have to turn blue this will take approximately 60 seconds okay it's blue perfect so it's full it's, really it's red it's flashing red a yes, constant it's red flash yeah constant red flash all right please can you stay in the line okay Just like the owner. How do you own our wife? Oh my gosh. Um, Thank you. Um, working friends. Get into a. I like the view from there. Mm. <laughs> from the away from today. Or under. Everybody come on in my team. We know what is going to be your birthday in the city and in the building. Hey my darlings, it is a new day, it is a new day, it is a Saturday, TK is coming, we're gonna have a little cutesy bride, very very cute, nothing too hectic, nothing too major, I don't know if I like these shades with this, but, so yeah, TK will be coming, I'm going to be spicing the meat right now while I wait for him, I should probably play some music and just entertain myself. And then my brother was supposed to come and join us. He was supposed to come with the shisha. He has shisha. We're supposed to chill in the backyard, smoke shisha. I'm gonna, I was going to make them cocktails. And we're just going to have a really good time. But he went to go see his friends before. Um, like our thing, our show here at home. And I just had a feeling that he was going to let me down and just not come. And just stay where his friends are. Which is kind of what is already happening so right now i'm on the hunt for shisha rentals because there's no way me and tk are just gonna sit and look at each other in the eyes we are gonna need to smoke some shisha some hookah so i am um, i literally put a poll on my story to ask if there are any shisha rentals in centurion or pretoria hopefully i get something nobody knows a shisha rental around here so disappointing so 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 disappointing tk is on his way he's on his way with the tequila i can't wait to just have a margarita going down my throat honey okay um so he has to buy the tequila fortunately for me my mom actually has the real margarita stuff okay the big dog we've actually got triple sec which is what that lady was telling me at the alcohol store when i was looking for my bar trolley stuff so this is great we've got some triple sec we've got the margarita mix how much alcohol is in here i'd like to know um percentage you guys were okay i can't see oh wait but lemon lime usually doesn't have i don't know we'll see 
And then we've also got strawberry daiquiri as well. I don't know what this is. Let me put this back. And then we've got strawberry daiquiri. So this is what we have. And then plus the tequila that's still coming. The meat is defrosting up here. I'll put it in the sun. To basically defrost. Don't know if it's defrosted enough oh this is how it works this is so crazy i haven't been on this vlog in a long while let alone that i also haven't held the camera in also quite a long time so do forgive me but right now um we are setting up because we're just gonna have like a an afternoon evening type thing in where we're literally just gonna be having some margs and i'm gonna bry and there's the host with the most <laughs> But this is what we're doing. Plants until we cut the cut. <laughs> yeah, so when you're editing this level, it's like cut the cut because I know exactly you know what you're doing. But anyway, let's get to it. When you they move, see green lights when I look at you. Cause I'm a dick. 